was that? It was probably just a squirrel. Anyways, I wish father would have a little more faith in me. I mean, I'm a grown woman now. I can make my own choices. I want more than just the village tavern hall. I want to get out there and see the world. It's not fair! Did you keep it down? Do you want bandits to hear you? In this part of the country? Pa said bandits haven't been seen in these parts in nearly two decades. Yeah, but bandit attacks have been up and they're spread to all corners of the kingdom. We're sure to lose our hamlet soon. Please. There's no way we could have bandit attacks this close after the king's death. He'll be alright. If you say so. dangerous in these parts. It'd be a real shame if you came out here and ran into the wrong company. So tell me, where's the village? How many men are there? How many horses? Save it, you runtish pig nut. I'll die before I tell you anything. Ooh, this rabbit's got a bit of a bite. I like it when they're rough. I think I'll keep this one for myself. <laughs> Did you sleep well? You were out for about a day and a half. I wasn't sure if I'd find you. Where's Jacob? He's gone. Back to the village, I assume. He's safe, I assure you. Slate and his men are gone, but that won't be for long. Come on, we've got to get going. We've got a long walk and a lot of brush ahead of us. Wait a minute. Who are you? That's of no concern. We have to get you back to the village. I can handle myself. <laughs> Slate had you out number two to one. You barely survived. You're lucky I was even there. I had a knife. I, I, I was waiting for him to get close, and then I was going to stab the pig in his... Say you did kill him. What then? You're still out number two to one, and how many more in the woods? You're lucky to be alive. Never mind. Let's keep going. Sir, I don't mean one to make suggestions, but I don't think it's a good idea to keep... If you ever tell me how to run this crew again, I'll cut off your fingers and feed them to you myself. I've been humiliated by this red marauder for far too long. We're going to hunt him down and gut him like the dog he is. We should be getting there very soon. Just stay close. <laughs> witchcraft so they ran her out of town. I haven't seen her since. But it's alright though. I I learned a lot from her and I look up to her. I 
that's why I want to get out there and travel and see the world. That's a noble goal, but it takes more than just howling with wolves out here to survive. It's not all sunshine and flowers. I know. Just wish people like you could understand and know what I can do. They're not far now. I'd say about two miles away. Excellent work. We shan't fall behind, shall we? So what lord did you serve, Sir Knight? What? Well, you're definitely not a self-sword based on your armor and your fighting skills, so you must have served for one of the royal family at some point. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, come on. I thought knights were always supposed to be proud to talk about who they fought for. It's not about who I fought for. It's about keeping my past myself. Whatever you say. I find it strange that you're all the way out here and not protecting your lord. Listen, when I said I don't want to talk about it, I meant it. I have my reasons for being here, and so do you. So just keep your nose out of my business. Go. I'll hold him off. Go! Let on a good fight earlier, you red dog. Though this time, you don't have the advantage of surprise, and quite frankly, you're outnumbered. Kill him. Ah! Ah! No! Son of a whore. Sir Walter, isn't it? Remember me? It's been some time. Still running like the coward you are? After carrying the shame of letting your king die? No! Ah! 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 A fitting end to a cowardly guard. Oh, you little bitch! I'll gut you like a fish! Just you try it! wrap up my injury. Why didn't you tell me you were Kingsguard? It was my greatest dishonor. I was sworn to protect the king and I just couldn't. They ambushed us. They came from all sides. I tried my best, but I just couldn't do it. And I ran. And I've carried that guilt with me ever since. What happened wasn't your fault. You tried to defend him and no one can fault you for that. He may have died, but you lived to avenge him. You're a strong man, sir. Thank you, Miss Amelia. Amelia. Thank you, Miss Amelia. The village should just be beyond that corner. Come on, we might be in time for supper. You go on ahead. My duty here is done. Why not come back with me to the village? We could really
really use a protector like you around. With you around, they've got all the protection they need. Besides, I have my own journey to go on. I'm headed back to the capital to rejoin the army. It's the least I can do to fix this broken world. And I wish you safe travels, Sir Walter.